How's it going everybody? You got Bison here coming at you with a player review from FIFA 16 of Hugo Lloris, the French goalkeeper. I'm reviewing back-to-back -back French players in honor of Paris. So here we go. Remember, I already proclaimed De Gea the best goalie in the Premier League, so Lloris has a lot to live up to. Guys, please comment with what you want to see next for reviews, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Team of the Year up soon. Here we go. So generally over the last few years, Loris has been well liked within the FIFA population. As opposed to one year where I hated the card, he has generally been a pretty quick goalie with great reflexes and great diving. His downfall in the past has been his positioning. How is he this year? Well, even though he has the exact same stats as last game, he got downgraded by one in his overall stat. But generally guys, I have a lot of positive things to say about this card. The number one thing that distinguishes Hugo Lloris from other goalies is how quick he gets to the ball. He is very speedy, he's fast in net, he has great agility kind of walking around in net. Not a thing I talk about a lot with goalies, but he has it. And not just with that, the traditional great characteristics of Hugo Lloris, the diving and reflexes are fantastic. On close shots and long shots, he reacts very quickly and when you have great reflexes, it is very rare you don't have great diving on a card. Now, the one thing that's always been a little iffy with Hugo Lloris is his positioning. It's an 81 on this card, however, in general, his positioning was pretty good. He doesn't leave too much space to one side or another, and when he was in net, his position was pretty good, and when it was a little inconsistent at times, his diving and reflexes would make up for it. So to summarize this card quite simply, he is not the best goalie in the Premier League, he's only an 84, and De Gea is clearly a little bit better, but he doesn't have many flaws. The big three stats, positioning, diving, and reflexes are all great, and the speed also helps a lot. Yes, his handling isn't great, but I've kind of ruled that out of my reviews because no goalie has great handling besides the top tier of goalies in this game. Loris is a great deal, he's a great card, he's very consistent, pretty cheap. Get him, he will do well for you, and if you want a little bit better, you can pay that price for De Gea, but Loris, I have nothing but good things to say about this card this year. Final rating for Hugo Loris will be a 9.0 out of 10. Again, a really good goalie, just not the best in this league, but will do a great job for you. Let me know what you guys thought of this card. Was I wrong? Who do you want to see next? Sound off below. Thank you guys for watching, and hope to see you guys next time.